Hi, I'm Carl. Um, I went to Camp Pride two years ago, and I just want to say how thankful I am for that experience because I went to the University of Notre Dame. I actually attended it because it was rated the number one gay unfriendly university by the Princeton Review. And you know, I wanted to make a change. I wanted to break down these walls, bring rights to my students. And when I got there, nothing happened. It was demoralizing to see us fail year after year, looking back on our history and seeing how many decades people have failed over and over again. It was heartbreaking. But then I came here and I made an action plan that, you know, I want to create the first LGBTQ student organization on our campus. I mean, it seems so far-fetched at the time, like, how can, like, one person really change that just by going to a camp? But it was transformative to come here. Not only did I gain tools to speak, to plan, to just be myself, it made me into a tool, and I realized that, you know, one voice can be the one that gets an entire crowd going. And that's what I did. I talked, I used my own experiences as a tool, and I got everyone else talking because when you're on a campus that isn't very friendly towards your identity, and you're behind that closet door, sometimes you only hear the voices that are loudest. And we all know that those angry voices are the ones you hear the loudest. But if you make your voice heard, you get other people to whisper words of kindness to you, it gets louder and louder, and that's what you need to have people hear. And I let my voice get heard, and now, surprisingly, we're getting our first LGBT student organization next year. So you never know what'll happen. Just take a chance, be yourself, and lead with your heart. Thanks, Camp Pride.